I have been buying an e-bike for two weeks now, and its brakes use a brake cable. I am not very satisfied with it after using it. I want to replace it with a hydraulic brake to improve the braking performance. I purchased this product, and its whole spacing is 70 for millimeters, which is in line with my e-bike. The brake components of the front wheels are connected, which will be very convenient for me to install. There is no need to worry about all leakage, however, the brake components of the rear wheels are separate, meaning that the brake lever and hose are separate. This design should be for the convenience of passing through the hose from the inside. I used the provided wrench to remove my brake cable, then removed the brake handle. I reinstalled the hydraulic brake in its original position, then reinstalled the brake lever in its original position, and then wrapped the hose onto the body with ties. Cut off excess length of ties. I understand that there is a risk of oil leakage when I need to connect the hose and brake lever together, so I need to be extra careful. I twist open the sealing cover of the brake handle. As stated in the installation manual, at this time, I cannot pinch the brake handle, otherwise the oil may splash all over me. Then I looked at the end of the hose and found that it was sealed with a small screw. I used the provided small screwdriver to open it and also took care not to spill the oil. I put in the sleeve, screw, and copper sleeve one by one. Then use my hand to push the hose to the bottom of the brake handle. Maintain this position, and then use a wrench to tighten the screw after twisting a few more turns with force. I can close the sleeve, the entire process is not very difficult, just be very careful. Then, I reconnected the disconnected wires, sorted out the positions of each wire, and finally, I rotated the adjustment screws to obtain a comfortable feel. After installation, I didn't notice any friction, so I couldn't wait anymore to go cycling. It was a perfect upgrade experience for my e-bike.